Hi you, welcome back to our Pokemon Crystal series. In the last episode, we got the very first badge. Uh, we also hatched the egg Professor um, Elm's aid gave us. And in this episode, we'll be heading to Azalea Town. Which means we need to head south. Which means we've got a couple encounters. And a trainer battle. So at Route 32, the egg ended up being a Wigglytuff. And we caught a Nidor Nidorino in uh, Sprite Tower. That's kind of ironic. Probably shouldn't have switched. Because that's probably going to one hit me. Okay, absorb's not super effective. I've made a mistake there. I'm going to take the opportunity to switch back into Aerodactyl, but should stay asleep. But yeah. I made a mistake, I made a, made a mistake though. Don't know why I thought, why would it be, why would the grass be super effective given that it's, given that it's a um, flying type as well as rock? If it was just primarily rock on its own, we'd probably... Probably would get the um, colorful heal. Not nope, route thirty-two encounter. A Sancho would be able to have a sand slash. Can we just throw a pokeball? One, no. There's five levels. Um, what can we do? I'm gonna switch to Buzz to Fury Attack because the levels, the level difference is a lot lower, and it's just Defense Code as well, so we should be fine. Yeah. With your attack three times. And then some damage. Um we'll throw a pokeball. One, two, three, yeah. Got a sentry. Yeah. Oh, tamer. Oh, tried to about that trainer. The present union cave still uh further south. Or am I missed it? Probably definitely missed it. Gonna sell the twelve. He used Leah. Then I've missed the cave. And that's it. I'm putting that cave ruin about. My needs to continue to continue in south. 
I'm completely lost. <laughs> um, in a Union Cave. I guess not. It's definitely, definitely, we definitely need to keep going south. Out to walk into a new trainer. Down there, make sure I'm going the right way. Gonna zoom around. That actually counters a lot of what we've got. Um, squiggle should be fine because water or grass. You just defense cover. That's actually pretty beneficial. Because we are faster, we can use absorb. And the, it's doing three health tools, but we're also taking more of that back. Use tail, but it failed. Interesting. Because I'm, I'm assuming there's a one in some chance that all these moves can fail and miss. Um, yay, level, level 12. I think we just need to. I think we just need to keep heading south. Okay, we've already got our encounter. Go back to the book. Hmm. Sounds true. Slow pot out, okay, we're gonna heal. He wanted to slow pot out for him, he wanted. Oh, well, I'd walk straight into the train now. Admittedly, I didn't need to. I mean, to claim that I didn't need to turn around. What clearly means. I was going the right way, then got confused and went back up for no reason. Oh, tend to crawl. Cause gets the poison. Luckily, we're near, we're near a Pokemon Center, so I'll just go run back and heal. So may as well keep my full heal, I'm just going to stay in, because it's going to be it's easy. Because, admittedly yeah, we have things that can take down a Spiro, but Spiro also super active moves on with my two other level of Pokemon. I haven't got around to leveling uh, Wigglytuff or Nidorino yet. Can we can heal again. We hope to see you again. A little bit weird. The Union Cave is where we need to go. What kind of berry? No. Oh. Train. Not like all the trainers. Let's go giraffe rig. Oh, that tail's just so strong. But mainly, if you ever face an ice type, like a proper ice type, like a high level, like an, another Articuno, but like level 30, we will show what we could do finding a fire type, which we haven't found yet. That's, that is actually something we just haven't found. Is fire type, but majority of everything else, 
Rocky should be able to cover. No, and bite, so it can now take on uh, ghosts and psychics. No, I sort of straight into the path of the trainer. Two Pokemon, Chikorita. And just wing attack. Because wing attack just one hits things. And a Pidgeot. So the typings we're probably looking for are probably an electric type. I think I'd say let you got ice ourselves. I get crit. Which one's it? Which one hits the Pidgeot? Okay, hey, Union came and came to please me some up. That's a do do the do duo. See, I'm gonna run from the do duo because I just don't think the do duo is gonna help us at all. Music mail. We should be close to the exit. It's the last, last code we've had. Well, that's annoying. That's a look. That's a. Oh, look what you could have had. You could have had this sweeping. It's like, it's kind of annoying. But that's the that, that that's the look of the draw at times. You'll have routes where you encounter loads of good things, and you have routes that you'll encounter nothing. Next exit's here. So it's day three. We should have one more encounter. Ooh, Steelix. I, what, I don't know why. Steelix. I really want. I've got three balls. Three pop balls are. Can I have one bullet? No. Okay, I, I, I physically can't. I don't physically think I can hit it with uh, that tile. Unless we try and. Bite. Yeah, I know. I know we got a crit, but I don't really want to chance our luck. <laughs> Use the power that we found. <laughs> we got the Steelix. Uh, we'll name it. Um, I don't know. Name it. Minute, 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 real. Now we're in Celia Town. So we've got the slope up well. Um, That'll be of course where we end today's episode, so thank you for watching, please remember to like, subscribe, and until next time, see ya!